it is recording. Hey guys, um, guess what time it is? New Black Wing Volumes time. Um, I just got home from work. I stopped by the post office on the way home because I was pretty sure these would be there and they were. So I figured why not do an unboxing? Um, yeah, I already know what they are because I've already seen the official Black Wing page. Um, but I haven't, you know, of course, actually seen them and I was looking at it on my phone. So I wasn't looking at a very good or big picture. So, um, I still think I'm going to be a little bit surprised by it, but I do know, um, kind of what the general theme is, but let's go ahead and get these guys opened up. Also, I apologize that the lighting is not ideal. Um, like I said, I just got home from work, so it's about five o'clock and it's winter, which means that no daylight but hey that's what editing software is for right right um anyway so open it up and this is what the inside of the box looks like Whoop. and i've had to turn the autofocus on the camera off because like because the lighting isn't great it keeps wanting to like try and refocus so i will focus when i hold things up close to it but otherwise i'm not going to bother to like try and refocus it all the time so what is in here is obviously the box um, as per the usual. And so I will focus on this guy, focus. I think that's in focus. So this is the volume 530. Here is the back of the box. Um, yeah, the volume 530. And this is supposed to be the uh, the Gold Rush sort of volume. Um, doop, 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 doop. The Blackwing 530 celebrates these eureka moments. Um, the model number 530 is a tribute to Sutter's Mill, California historical site number 530, where gold was first discovered. And so if you couldn't guess by now, the pencils are gold. Um, so let's open it up. And again, they have this little description. I'm pretty sure they put this online, so I will just make sure to link to the website for this one. Um, I, I don't want to try and like hold it up and have you guys read it, but I will link to the description um, for these. But yeah, they are this really beautiful gold lacquered pencil. So let's see if I can both hold this up and try and focus it with my other hand. There we go while not drifting the pencils. So yeah, so it's a gold lacquer and it has a black band on the ferrule, gold ferrule and a black eraser and black imprint. So I think it looks really great and oh, refocus. Um, and let's see, what did they say? And the, so it's a gold finish, striped gold ferrule, black imprint, extra firm graphite. So, um, my understanding with that is that that is then the same graphite that's in the 24, which I know a lot of people wanted that put in another pencil or made like a stock Blackwing graphite. So at least they've now gotten it in another volumes edition. Um, but yeah, so that's that. It's a gold pencil. And I'm trying to think of what else, what else is in here? So they have a little card for, um, a digital download of a song if you're a subscriber um this this thing and then also apparently you can um uh, if you are a subscriber so of course you would already know this then um they are putting out the blackwing point guard and it says blackwing point guard will be available for purchase on blackwing602.com starting december 13th um so that's interesting i guess um kind of cool because especially because black wings don't tend to fit in regular pencil cases it would be nice to have a little thing to protect your point but yeah that's that and then this is of course the tubed version of the pencil so nothing too fancy um yeah so i think this is a really smart edition right so this is kind of the end of the year december 2016 um edition to come out and i think this was a super smart choice because aesthetically speaking these are great pencils to release right around the holidays right like i mean come on how much more of like a holiday pencil could you have than like a gold pencil um because it's not like an obvious like screaming holidays sort of pencil but like 
definitely gold makes its way into like Christmas decorations a lot. So, um, and this just in general fits a very specific aesthetic that I know will appeal to a lot of people who aren't maybe necessarily pencil people. Like these are people who want to have a very pretty sort of desk and everything color themed and all of that. Um, I think these are right up their alley. So I think this was a super smart addition, um, you know, to put out right around Christmas and kind of going into New Year's because again, New Year's definitely tends to have gold um, sort of decorations. So yeah, and just aesthetically speaking, I really like it. Um, the last edition, the, I don't even remember the number, um, the like dark room sort of one, the Dorothy Lang one, um, did not speak to me as much aesthetically, but I really, really like these ones. I think they're super pretty, um, and I just don't really have any complaints about them. And I haven't used the 24 a ton, um, so like I haven't used this extra firm graphite very much, but I have a test to write up for my stats class. It's my final like take home exam um, that I have to get finished up tonight and you know get then I have to rewrite it because my first draft is just a mess. So you better believe I'm going to be sharpening one of these guys up and using it to write up my test and hopefully that will give me a fair amount of kind of experience with this extra firm graphite and maybe I'll try and get a proper review done on this sort of graphite from Palomino because I did my review on the three kind of standard black wings, but I haven't done anything about the extra firm graphite. So yeah, that would be a good thing to do. So yeah, um, just one more time. I will try and get these up close and focused. Doop, doop, focus. Oh, too far. So that's what they look like. Hopefully I will edit it better um, so that it looks a little bit nicer than it looks currently on my screen but that's what it looks like and i am just pleased as punch with them and i can't wait to sharpen one up and use it so good job blackwing i wasn't as crazy about the last one i love this one I, I don't really care so much about like the story behind it um it just doesn't mean anything to me but aesthetically speaking i think this one's a home run and i love it so good on you blackwing um, yeah, let me know what you guys think. If you, like, if you're a subscriber or, you know, whatever, and you have the pencils, let me know what you think of them. If you've just seen the pencils, let me know what you think of them. Would you buy them? Do you like them? Are they just kind of a meh one for you? Um, let me know what you think. And thanks for watching, and I will see you guys later. Bye!